Return on investment is a calculation that shows how an investment or asset class has performed over a certain period of time expressed in percentage terms. The formula for calculating return on investment is very simple. It's simply the last value minus the beginning value divided by the beginning value. So let's test this out. In our table, we can see that the last price for 2018 was 115, and our beginning price was 100, and therefore, the return on investment is 15%, and this carries through throughout the table. Following financial modeling best practices, we do want to break out each different year as its own line item to get a sense of where the return on investment was up and subsequently down. One advantage of return on investment is that it's so simple and comparable. We can say, hey, this asset in the year 2020 returned us negative 18%, but hypothetically, some other asset returned us a positive return. Now, the big problem with this is that it doesn't consider the time value of money. It is preferable to link the returns year over year, which is effectively an annual rate of return or a compounded rate. Whereas this just takes each year in static and assumes that this is an arbitrary endpoint in our calculation. But this video shows you the basics of how to calculate it, and it's quite simple to do.